In this video I show how to connect the servo to the flight controller SP Racing F3 or F4 and what is it for? Hello everyone, привет все and welcome back to very excited video blog. So when you want to get a camera stabilization or necessary to fix the camera at the certain angle 45 degree for example, why not use the built-in function of the flight controller? This would require a small servo, link can be found in the description. Many instructions to different the flight controllers say what is necessary to move on two pins, the pins of motors, after activate mode of servo tilt. It is not right. Your servo will not work after this. Servo is connected in reverse order. For example, 8 it is pin number 1, 7 it is pin number 2. We have three wires that go from the servo. Brown is a ground, red is a plus and yellow is a signal. In my design I need to remove the yellow wire from the plug. The flight controller has a lower pin, it is a ground. Next up the power and the Top pin is a signal.
But first I need to enable the function in configuration of Quadracopter. I'm using the Betafly. It is a similar to CleanFly. On the tab configuration, need to activate Servo2 checkbox. After this, save and reboot your controller. Also, necessary to enable expert mode and go to the tab Motors. On this tab, if you move quadracopter left-right, you will see what activate servo number one and servo number two when you change the position of a quadracopter also change value in interface of Betafly or CleanFly. So, you can assign any switch of remote controller to turn this mode on tab modes. Parameter is a cam step. In the server tab, you can set the sensitivity or set manual control of the servo. Ok, back to the quadrocopter. Let's connect servo to pin 1. You see, as soon as I change the pitch servo, response to change. If you connect servo to pin 2, the servo will respond to the roll. You can use both servo or separately. Do not forget to use the RC filter protection when using servo. Today that's all. I will be grateful if you help me buy a new camera or make a small financial contribution or just write some comments. Also best way say thank you to the author is share this video with your friends. I will hope to see you next time.